Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So summer is here. So let's make these three simple mocktails that don't need a lot of prep or even ingredients first. So without further ado, let's make this, shall we? So first, let's start with the virgin watermelon mojito. So we're going to take a big app watermelon and cut these into cubes. And then also we need a line, which we're going to cut into quarters. Then in a glass, add all those watermelon cubes, a one fourth lime slice, some mint leaves, and then muddle everything together. Also, you can add a teaspoon of sugar. But anyways, we're going to top it off with some Sprite. So even if you don't add it, that's fine. Then in a glass, add some seedless watermelon cubes, two to three slices of lime slices, few mint leaves, and then muddle. Add some ice cubes and then add your concentrated melon mixture. And probably you should strain it first or this will happen <laughs> once strained add that in a glass and top it off with some sprite mix it up and garnish with whatever you like here i did with some watermelon slices and mint leaves and that's done now let's move on to the classic virgin mojito it's so easy to make that we are literally starting it in the glass first add about half a lime and some mint leaves muddle it add some ice and top it off with some sprite mix it well and that's done now i know that some people add sugar syrup but sprite is already kind of sweet as i mentioned before so no need to add more right now once you're done with that and the mango season is here so we have to make some chilled mango lassi so first being on youtube we have to cut the mangoes into these cute little cubes then scoop out all the good stuff from the two mangoes then add it in a blender with some sugar salt cardamom powder half a cup of dahi or yogurt, two tablespoons of fresh cream and lastly some ice cubes. Blend it all up, pour the chill lassi in a glass or matka, garnish with some mango cubes and mint leaves and it's done. Now you saw how easy these were, like the version mother you can literally make from the ingredients you have in your fridge. So do try these out, let me know your feedback in the comment section and subscribe if you haven't already by the way and until then I'm going to see you in the next one.